Uh, it's my product, uh, Zuvo. And it's a. Uh, Yeah. <laughs> Tell them what um, it is. <laughs> basically, it's like the VR headset that like helps with CGI films. As like you can see nowadays, they use motion capture, mm -hmm. and you can't really capture the immersiveness of what it's supposed to feel like. Mm -hmm. But like this, uh, you know, it gives people a chance to create their own scenes. Obviously, gives them custom models and uh, also presets. So it's like a prototype software for um, set design, kind yeah. of CGI. That's quite fantastic, yeah. Uh, it fills a lot of gaps in the market, especially mm -hmm. with um, virtual reality becoming an ongoing thing. As you can see, Save Every Breath, the Dunker experience has been made, and uh, this was a lot of CGI, and to make it immersive for a viewer, could also be the same for the actor. Uh, my main target audience is 20 to 65 year olds, mainly because that's like the age range of directors around these days, but it's also open to colleges and universities to use, it, to use by students. The social grade C1 to B is just because it's a rather expensive pro product and uh, these are the main social grades that could probably afford that. And the main side graphics, mainstreamers due to the product being used in mainstream films, but also more indie producers to use, so it could be around uh, Explorer or, yeah. Uh, just the finances, obviously a VR headset, it's not a lot to afford. So I probably finance this by using Kickstarter as anything, say with my CGI software. Uh, with Blender being a free product to create uh, 3D models, I would uh, just use that, or I could use the annual price of Photoshop, which is only Hundred and nineteen pounds by nine. Mm. Uh, obviously, to roll this, I would need a PC. So these are just the prices of what could run Blender and Photoshop. Uh, I'd probably use the bottom line advertising, due to being a more mainstream product. Bus wrapping, um, social media advertisements, a social media trailer, mm. and a, a longer trailer on YouTube that would go they'll be more. Uh, distribu uh, distribution, um, it would cost around £500 as the recommended retail price. I mainly chose this because normal VR products, say the, uh, I think it's the HP one, it's, a, yeah, yeah, the it's around £500, £600. Yeah. So I have to do, yeah, I have to look into that. And then obviously the software it runs, I would have to charge a monthly subscription, but there's also a free version if you can, yeah. Can I just say, chat? So, just to just to clarify, the actual headset create you can you can build your own VR environment in the headset for films. Just yeah, like a set design. Set I guess. design. I guess that's what you're thinking about, isn't it? Yeah, it's yeah. Like, so being able to be able to bring in props and and build a CGI environment in right. VR. That's yeah. what it is, isn't it? Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, no, I, I, yeah. I was going to say the the Quest it, before. I, yeah, <laughs> the Quest is good, a good headset because that's more mobile um, than um, the Vive because the Vive relies on the, the PC. Mm. Um, but the, the Quest Two is is something that we're using. Yeah. Um, and for the software, you could you could look into. Um, I mean, it, it's almost like tilt. Have you looked at Tilt Brush? The, uh, no, <laughs> that's that's a that's a software where you can. Draw in the environments. Um, That's draw. the one that I've looked at when I've been to Europe before. You know, yeah, well, you know, the we kids' did. change, remember? Yes, 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 mm. yes. So it's, it might be worth looking at, but you can watch videos on it, you know, on Tilt Brush yeah. online. <laughs> and you know, you won't look at access to it, but that's that's something you could look at for a, a, something that's similar to what you could see. You, in that, you can create an environment with mm. with, a, with with a brush you know, and an art you know and space in, in a space like that so it's similar to what you're thinking about um, but in terms of your, your list of things as well unity um, and unreal are probably two programs that you should look at as well for building the app if, if i know, I know yeah. that's not what you're doing but just for research purposes yeah uh, yeah we're looking at those two as well, 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 well interesting idea Thank you.